Hello, I'm Tom, the developer of the generic log viewer, and I would like to give you a short overview about the new features of the version 6.0. First of all, I upgraded to .NET 4.8, which is released two years ago, so I think you have it already on your PC. Next, I integrated the support of command line arguments and drag and drop of files. This is a very nice feature, you will love it. It allows you to drag and drop files on a shortcut on your desktop or directly into a running generic log viewer. And last but not least, I added some smart features to the change all button. You will see it in the demo. Let's start the demo how you can drag and drop files. First of all, I want to drag and drop on a shortcut. So I create a shortcut. I do a right click on the executable of generic log viewer and click create shortcut. Shortcut is created. I drag and drop it to the desktop. Now you can drag and drop log files on this shortcut, which means it will be opened with generic log viewer. You have select the application which generated the log file like normal and tool is up and running and dropped log file is loaded. You can do the same with two or three log files. For example, I take now two, drop it on the shortcut, select again and tool is up and running with the two log files. Or you can drag and drop directly into the tool. I do this now with the third log file. Load it and even with the setup file. Chuck. If you have a preferred setup, I recommend to define the setup file directly in the shortcut. I can show you how you can do this. So do a right click on the shortcut and select properties. In the target field, you can append the file location of your setup file. I use this one as an example. That's it. Now, if you drag and drop a log file on the shortcut, the setup file is loaded too. Now let's have a look at the smart features of the change all buttons. I think in most of the cases you do the following. You have a new log file created and you want to have a look on it. So from now on you can take the log file and drag and drop it on the shortcut. Generic log viewer is starting up and by default, the first log category in one diagram is shown. That's the default startup situation. Normally, I want to have a quick overview about most of the categories. So what can I do? I can use the arrow keys to work through all categories or I can direct select the wanted category. But both scenarios are not perfect for me. First of all, I want to see more diagrams at the same time. Let's say six. So let's configure that. As you can see, all diagrams show now the same first log category. What I want to have, I want a feature like scrolling page by page. So if I click on the next button, change all, it changes now to First lock category, second lock, cat lock category, third lock category, fourth, fifth, and sixth. If I press again, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So the change all arrow keys support now a scrolling page by page feature. Backwards works also. If I click previous, it jumps back to one, two, three, four, five, six. A pair mode is also supported. Let's configure such a pair situation. So I go back to the init state, means six 
diagrams. But now I want to have on the right side the corresponding triple charts. If you press now, next button, you got one, two, three, and the pair one, two, three. Again, four, five, six, corresponding four, five, six. Backwards is also working. I think the smart change all buttons are a very cool feature to get an overview over all categories. That's it. I hope you enjoy the new features of the version 6.0 and give me a thumbs up if you like it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.